Hey, guys. Eh? I don't normally do this, but I did this this morning. This morning or this afternoon when I was cooking, I saw I showed Dogu Boo Boo. I saw her video talking about uh, how she said people should stop asking her about her pregnancy. I went to read comments. I said, like, seriously? People are asking her about her pregnancy. And she got angry. Yes, she brought the pregnancy on social media. She's a social media person. So she's free to drop anything she wants to drop on, uh, on social media. And we are free to comment whatever you want to comment. She will reply you. So, do you know one thing? Do you know why I'm making this video? Immediately I dropped my comment. My instinct told me that this lady will block me. I use my page, Lord will go there to drop this comment. Look at my comments. Why? Because I met Aisha in a life international hospital in Oka Life two times with her baby. I met her two times in life specialist hospital in Oka with her baby. I congratulated her. I greeted her and I congratulated her. Then why are you coming to make video for people to come and start pitying you or for people to come and start saying sorry? My comment is not harmful. Even I told my sister and my children at home that time. I said, let me screenshot this my, this my comment. My mind is telling me that this lady will block me. I screenshot it. I screenshot this. Thing. All of a sudden, I noticed that I was blocked. Yes, how do I notice? My mind just told me now, after my live stream, check that comment. I can't even use my profile to see it. I'm, not, I'm sorry, my page to see her page again. Even the ones her husband shared it. So she blocked me because I said that she should stop creating content with everything. No, my sister, Asha, I know probably you will see this. You are free to create content with anything, but not to be lying about your pregnancy. You were pregnant and you successfully gave birth to a healthy child. You did. You gave birth to a healthy child. I saw you with your child at Life International, International Specialist Hospital in Oka, Agwaka. I saw you now. And I greeted you. The first day you were coming with one guy. The second day I saw you with your, with your husband and with your, with your boy. And you were carrying your baby with, I think, your house girl or whatever. Then you came to the social media. At least, everybody should read my comments. At least you tell people, I've delivered though. Probably I don't want to show my baby's face on social media. It's a different thing. Haba. Why content creating will make us the go gaga? Now, nah, it's short. It go block my page. <laughs> You could say this to my this one carry your wahala go. My sister, but an advice I give you. Everyone should read my comments. An advice I give you. First of all, if you don't want people to know that you are pregnant, you wouldn't have brought your pregnancy to social media. Oh yes, you wouldn't have brought your to, you wouldn't have brought it out to, to social media. But I saw it and I commented because I saw you with my eyes. You don't need to use the innocent child to lie. No, I watched your video to the end. You didn't say anything. You are just saying, mm, I don't want to cry, I don't want to cry. But you're already feeling somehow so that people will pity you and start watching your video. I beg you. Now I'm going to continue.